Well, I've already told you that I do this thing called Living ASAP as sustainably yeah. as possible. And I do that 24-7. So I gave up flying, you know, nearly 20 years ago and I gave up driving over 20 years ago. And I basically live my whole life in that kind of way and I love doing it. And I want to share with other people. I'm also really good at getting things wrong. And my character bag lady is just really, she's very, very passionate about caring for the planet but she does make mistakes so i'm just wondering if you would be able to help me if you think that school kids would be able to help me to just basically work out right here's this um here's this bottle i shall go and get it for you in a minute but here's this bottle it's called chocolate almond or something or other and it's a beautiful chocolate almond milk delicious but it's in a plastic bottle and that bugs me and I don't think it's right that I should buy that. And usually I don't, but I did the other day. And I think it's because I want to bring it up for people. I want to hold up that bottle and I want to say, look, is this OK? And I want to ask those sorts of questions of people so that we all really look at it gently and firmly together. And we make some decisions because what we buy is what they're going to produce and sell. Yeah. So what do you think about that stuff? I think that that's entirely true. I mean, I think that our society, it's very difficult to cut out plastics and things like that because we everything revolves around them. You know, you go to the supermarket and everything's in plastic or it's in uh, something that's unrecyclable. Or, heaven forbid, you know, you've got f fruit and veggies wrapped in plastic wrap. I mean, it's, 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 it's stupid. But I think that it's really true, you know. Um, the market is driven by the consumer. So to show that we don't accept this anymore and that that isn't good enough and, you know, we don't need plastic around apples, we should, you know, we've got to sh show companies that that's not going to sell anymore. And we, that's why we need people to know stuff like this, you know. That's why your um, bag lady, I think, would be is such an excellent idea and a thing, you know, you've worked on for a while, I, I, uh, I suppose. A but long time, that, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think people just need to realise that, I mean, you know, you can feel helpless and that's all well and good and it's true. I mean, there's so many things that we can't change. But simple things like choosing to not buy fruit and veggies wrapped in plastic, they, I mean, they don't make a difference on your scale. But when there's maybe 2,000 people doing that, that's quite a big thing. You know, that's companies are going to realise, oh, people don't buy things like that well we've got to change you know and that's how that's how change works and that's how it's always worked it's driven by people 